Hello everyone, we are here at 5637 Camilla Avenue out in Milton, Florida. This home right here has all the bells and whistles and I'm gonna take you through it today. So we're actually gonna start on the outside as this home does have two sheds. So one is a larger workshop style shed and the other one is more of a storage shed. But we're gonna go ahead and walk you guys over. And in the meantime, I'll go ahead and say that the roof, um, they had a new re-roofing about five years ago, and then they also have a new HVAC that was installed about two years ago. So already right there, huge win for this property. And here we are coming up on the first shed. So just to give you a good look there, and I'll give you a quick sneak peek inside just so you can see how much room you actually do have to work with in here. It is a concreted floor. You do have a garage door, so if you decide to use this for a boat or car storage or to keep it as a workshop um, like the owners have here, that's also just such a good convenient option. Walking over to our smaller shed. You'll see it is split by this awning coverage, so it's kind of like an open garage. So you do have some more storage space here. Again, maybe lawn equipment or whatever you can find most helpful for you. And then we'll take a look in the smaller shed. Both of these obviously will come with the property. Christmas storage can go in here. Holiday storage if you like to decorate. Extremely convenient. All right, and then as you can see, I mean, this backyard is gorgeous. So much room if you like gardening or you want to make a little gazebo pavilion out here. There is an exceptional amount of room to get creative. And I'm not sure if you can see it, but on the other side of the house, you actually do have your own private tennis course. So that's incredible. And we'll take a peek at that a little bit later. So I'm actually gonna bring you guys through the garage door, or I guess what you would say the shop door. And this right here is a fully enclosed shop area that's being used right now. But you could easily turn this into, you know, a, a separate living room. You could even turn it into another bedroom if you like. This is a three bedroom, three full bathroom house. And this is also our first full bathroom here. So you've got a single vanity. This is a walk-in shower here. And then you've got a little room for extra storage as well. Super convenient if you do wanna make this into some type of bonus room. And then in here, is where your laundry washer dryer hookups are, your hot water heaters in here. So this would be fantastic to be turned into like a mud room since it's right off the garage. If you have pets, I know that is super convenient for some people, but since it's already out here, that would be a great addition to like a really nice mud room. All right, so coming in from the shop area, you are immediately in the kitchen here. As you can see, there's in-kitchen dining, so you do have a little table here or room for it. You could build that out for a breakfast nook if you wanted to, but you also do have that bench seating on the other side. They did install this butcher block countertop, which I think looks so nice. It really gives more of like a farm feel. I think it's nice accent. And then there is that bench on the other side just for some added seating stainless steel appliances you have your double doored fridge freezer you've got your flat top electric oven and stove top you do have a vent there hooded vent and then your microwave off to the side <clears throat> with the dishwasher all right to the left of the door we just entered, you come into your formal dining room. 
Again, this space could stay as a formal dining room or you could turn it into an at-home office if you do work remote. Or you could even make it a formal living room if you'd like. And we'll go ahead and walk through here. So this is actually the front door. This is the view from the inside that you saw earlier. So now coming around here, this would be where you walk in from the front door. So again, that formal dining room that we just walked through to your right. And then the large living room and kitchen duo area straight ahead. So here we are, beautifully open floor plan for the kitchen to living. Got your TV there. And then also, we'll go ahead and take a sneak peek out here. They do have a sunroom right off the living room, which I think is so beautiful. So enclosed sunroom out here. <clears throat> it does have a window unit. So I think you can put AC and heat out here, <clears throat> bench seating, and then a nice door that leads out into the backyard. We'll check out the rest of that sunroom momentarily because you do have an entrance not only from the living room, but from the master bedroom as well. So tile and hardwood look flooring in here. And this wood flooring does go through all of the bedrooms. And we will come to our first bedroom here. Nice size bedroom. They do have a pull out here, which is nice, but I think you could definitely put in a nice full to queen size bed. You do have these accordion doors for your closet space there. As you can see, Nice little window right at the front of the house to get some good lighting and those built-in bookshelves as well. Okay. And then we come to our second full bathroom. So really large single vanity here. And then you also have your tub shower duo. So this one actually does have a tub, which is jetted, which I think is really nice to note. A nice little built-in for your tub shower duo. Okay. And then our second bedroom here. This one does have more of a walk-in closet than the last. Here you go. Nice two windows in this room. And again, all of these rooms are multi-purpose. So instead of a bedroom, if you're looking for office space, or an exercise room, like these still provide that type of sizeability. Okay, and then last but not least, our master bedroom. I do love this bedroom because not only does it have a really spacious full bathroom, it's got a nice size closet, and it also has your own access to the screened in patio outside. So here you have two mirrored sliding doors for your closet access. So really spacious closet here. And again, those hardwood floors just really warm up the space. Double doors to go out into the patio. And then you do have your own bathroom in here large tub shower duo, sliding glass doors. This is a single vanity right now, but it is large enough if you were to want to make it a double vanity, you absolutely could. The lighting is set up for that as well. And then you even have extra storage in here for linens or toiletries. All right, and then my favorite part, it takes you right out to your personal access of this patio. I'm actually not sure if it's screened in. It might just be blinds there, but look how beautiful and peaceful this is. Oh, yeah, it's definitely screened in. Screened in porch. Nice wood deck out here. 
We do have some seating, so uh, enough room to add outdoor couch. You could add a, a TV if you wanted to. Definitely could barbecue out there, and it is just lovely. So beautiful. All right, I'm actually going to sneak back through here. We're going to go outside so I can give you a good shot of the tennis court. And then that should conclude our tour for today. I mean, look at all this space. Like, you get to call this yours. I think it's so beautiful. If you enjoy, you know, yard work and landscaping, there's so much room out here to really get creative and make it your own. Florida does really well with fruit trees and citrus if, you know, you're interested in that. And then all the landscaping that you could provide out here and just make your own little private piece of paradise for yourself all right and then here is the tennis court as you can see it definitely would need a resurfacing but I would absolutely pay the cost of a resurface to have my own private tennis court I feel like that's pretty neat all right so again, this is 5637 Camilla Avenue out in Milton, Florida. You have so much space, so much land out here. The two additional sheds, three bedroom, three bathroom, and we are over 2,300 square feet. So we would love for you guys to come check this perfect piece out.